360, my dear and loving son John. Your good friend, the schoolmaster Pat McMara, so good as to write these words down. Your brothers have all got to find work in England. The house is so empty and sad. The crop of potatoes is sorely infected. A third to a half of them by. And your sister Bridget and Patrick O'Donnell are going to be married in. Says not to work on the railroad Be sure to come on home soon Kilkelly, Ireland, 18 and 17 My dear and loving son John Hello to your missus and to your four children they go healthy and strong. Michael has got in a wee bit of trouble. I suppose that he never will learn. Because of the dampness, there's no turf to speak of, and now we have nothing to burn. And Bridget is happy. Child for her, although she's got six of her own. You say you found work, but you don't say what kind. Or when you'll be coming your dear old mother has gone. We buried her down at the church in Kilkelly. Brothers and Bridget were there. You don't have to worry, she died very quickly. Remember her in your prayers. And it's so good to Michael's returning with money he's sure to buy land for the crop has been poor and the people are selling at any price that they can Dear brother 
job I'm sorry I didn't write sooner to tell you That Father passed on He was living with Bridget She says he was cheerful and healthy right down to the end you should have seen him playing with the grandchildren of Pat McMara, your friend. And we buried him alongside of Mother down at the Kilkelly churchyard. He was a strong and a feisty old man, considering life is so hard and it's funny the way he kept talking about you he called for you at the end oh, why don't you think about coming to visit we'd all love to see 